In this page maker review, I'm going to show you everything you need to know about the software page maker. If you have any questions, please be sure to comment them down below and I'll also be sure to leave a discounted link down there so you can always get your money's worth for PageMaker. PageMaker is a software where you can build landing pages and optimize your digital marketing with just one tool. This tool, which is the PageMaker software. So this is what you should see once you are logging into the software, entering the software, or even if you've just first signed up to the software in general. So this is pretty much the landing page of this software. There's not too much going on and there's not really a dashboard to actually dive into straight away. We just have the four main sections over here on this left hand side navigation bar and then some other account sections down in the bottom left. So we're gonna go ahead and just jump straight into it and start going through how we can actually make our landing pages, Amazon pages, and much more. So this tool is really good and this software is really good because you can actually go ahead and just have it all in one area with one tool, which actually helps you create landing pages without any skill for creating websites. This is also really good, again, because we actually have Amazon pages. So if there's any Amazon sellers, you can actually use this software to run your sales pages through this software. So again, let's go ahead and jump straight into it. We're gonna go to the top right hand corner and click create new to start creating our landing page, as you can see, which we are on the left hand side. So once you click create new, it should take you to this page where you can create your landing pages. So we have the site name you can write, description, and the favicon, which is pretty much a logo for your page. So we're gonna go ahead and actually give the site a name real quick and a description as well, and pretty much just fill in this information. So for the site name, I'm gonna write in reviews for the sake of the review, and then the same with the description. So then once you actually finish with that and actually chose your site name and description and are happy with your settings, you can go ahead and click continue. Next, it takes you to this section where you can actually choose a template for your landing page in case you aren't a very good web designer or something like that and you're just a beginner. So this software makes it so it's for everyone and you can actually go ahead, save yourself some time, effort and resources and get onto actually creating your landing page within a couple of minutes. So all you have to do is follow this one, two, three, four step process, select your template, select colors, select fonts and then setup complete. So as I'm scrolling through these templates, now you can see that all of them are really well professionally designed by whoever made this software. You can see all of them have different themes in case you're looking for a certain theme and you can actually preview them by scrolling through them or you can also preview them by clicking a larger preview with this little eye icon. Once you click the eye icon, you can see that it takes you to a larger website version of this so you can see a more in-depth version and see what you're actually getting into once creating or selecting your template. You can see as you scroll through it, it's just like a normal well-designed website, really well integrated and you can choose which one you find best. So I'm just gonna go ahead and choose a random one. Let's just choose, let's just choose the one that we previewed and then you click select on the one that you actually want to choose. It should then take you to the select a color section or the brand color section where if you actually have a brand you're designing a landing page for, this is where you can do that. You also have other colors if you don't have a brand color and maybe you want one suggested to you and save yourself some time from actually choosing one yourself. So we're gonna go ahead and just keep these brand colors pretty much the same. Maybe just change them a bit to show you guys how you can change it. Just select this little icon here and then find a color that your brand is. Really simple and easy for any beginners or even professionals that just want to, again, save themselves some effort and they don't really need to be focusing on the landing page and they wanna to get to actually promoting their product. Next, once you are done with that, click save and continue and move on to the font section. Pretty much the same as the color section, it just has the display and body, and you can choose the different fonts you want for those sections. So the display is more for headers and stuff like that in websites, and the body is more for information-based text. So go through these fonts and choose which one you maybe want. Maybe it's a brand font that you want, and you wanna go ahead and find it. It has a huge variety of fonts that you can look for. Choose whether you want it thin, normal, or bold. And then once you're happy with that, click save and continue. And there you go, it says ready to start. The site setup is complete. Now you can start creating and actually editing your pages once you've got the base outline of your landing page created. So just click go to site. And now we are on the main area where the landing pages are or where your new pages are being added. So you can easily just go to the top right hand corner and click add a new page, name it, you can also copy pages if you want and then give it to your domain. That's how easy it is with the pages. You can just go ahead and do that and your pages should then show up here. So if we added a new page, let's just name it reviews two 
click create and now we have our second page right below our home page that we just created on the analytics section you can see there's also analytics that actually appear on your landing page whether you want to see if your landing page link is actually getting any conversions or anyone actually landing on your page seeing if anyone's actually going onto your page overall is a good feature that saves yourself time in the software and actually gives you a better outlook on what your customers are maybe doing so you have your views your unique views and your form submissions and your conversion rate all of them will appear here with its own integrated data sourcing really easy to actually read and really easy to keep track of on the form section you can actually see if there's any forms or even something like that being added and then on the settings is where you change the main settings of your site like the name and description that we put at the start the design system is the colors and fonts which we already went through and then the customization is the same with the template that we already went through css as well if you want to add a new css same with javascript and plugins now this software actually has a couple of plugins as you can see here there's three from facebook google analytics and google tag manager you can actually add these if you want to go ahead and use them if you have some sort of account or way of using them and it's easy to go ahead and add them just from the plugin section on the domain section you can see your actual custom domain if you want to change that you don't want the one that page maker has actually provided so you can add your custom domain right here by just clicking add new domain and maybe one you've already bought really simple to actually add that so once you've actually gone through all of this and built up your website you can click export and export your website to the internet now a good thing about this software something that's really good is if you are an amazon seller and you are selling a product on amazon but you maybe want a landing page for that product this software provides that very easy and customizable for you to do this and it's very straightforward so it eliminates you actually going through the process of building it all yourself so on the amazon pages section if you're an amazon seller and you want to go onto this you can see that it also focuses on that area you just click create new in the top right hand corner and you can actually import your amazon product straight through a url which keeps it really straightforward and simple and you don't get confused throughout your products so i just went ahead and found a random amazon product online i just will copy and paste that in there now and then click continue and once you have pasted in your amazon product you can see i chose a camera these softwares automatically and independently uploaded all of this information without me having actually to do anything in a couple of seconds i've now got my product the product's photos name and all of the description which is really insane it's really good and straight to the point so you then just go ahead and name your site name again i'm just going to name it reviews for the sake of this review and then you can also customize your favicon as well and your listing price if you want to change it maybe at a discount or even a sale price you can add all that at the bottom you can also add coupon codes which is a really great feature if i do say so myself it just gets it more integrated for any amazon sellers so you can actually use this software for your sales so once you're happy with how you've put in your settings and products you can click create and now it takes you back to the section where we were before where it has the three to four step process on how to create your landing page pick your template colors fonts and setup complete and it takes you all the way back to what we went over before with the actual creation of your landing page it's very straightforward and to the point and it actually saves you a lot of time so you don't have to go around maybe even finding or hiring a web designer yourself you can do it all here from the software now onto the domain section you can actually also add a new domain if you want to by just clicking add new in the top right hand corner and it should bring up this section where you can type in your custom domain or maybe one you've bought and actually click continue then when you're on the other sections like the landing page and the amazon pages you can then add the domain that you've already put in and finally the integrations this software has a really big handful of integrations that you can use from payment processes like stripe where you can actually have a processed payment for your products and there you go that is it for the page maker software review overall there's a couple of features that i personally like and it's really straightforward and easy to make so if you're a beginner or even a professional you don't have to go ahead and actually find a web designer for ages you can do it all right here so again those features that i like is how simple it is you can do it all right from one tool software and i also like how it includes the amazon pages landing page for any amazon sellers out there that need a product landing page would i recommend this to anyone yes i would like i said before for professionals and beginners this is a great software for you guys in case you're an amazon seller or even just a normal seller would i use this software myself yes i would if i needed a amazon product landing page or even landing pages in general, I would use this software myself due to the intricate designs of the software. And I also really like the analytics page 
on how simple and easy it is to read. That's all for this video and I'll see you in the next video.